What's up guys? Welcome back to YouTube and welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing this. The Half Fryer, the Half Fryer, the Half Fryer 70 from Hanabishi. We got this. It, this was delivered earlier. Uh, we got this from Shopee uh, yesterday. It was very fast, right? Um, and yeah, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. Okay, so let's try opening the box, guys. Um, we got this from Shopee, Shopee Mall, Western Appliances, I believe. Yep, yep, Western Appliances. We got it for 3,500, 3,500 pesos. And um, I want to make sure that I get it from the mall so that I get to have the stuff. I want to make sure that I have the warranty so that at least if something goes wrong, it's going to be easier to file a claim for like a, a refund or an exchange, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna try to take it out of the box. Um, well, I'm gonna need two hands, so give me a second, guys. There, there you go. That's how, uh, what I bought was, well, this is like a three liter, it has like a three liter capacity, and then this one is a seven liter capacity. And this one, I'm gonna show you, um, basically, there so you can put like a just a whole chicken in there stick it in and then you're good you just have to set the uh, temperature and then the time you can see there basics basics see steaks 20 minutes it's very very fast you'd be surprised how fast it cooks so just to be clear they have no difference in terms of function why right? they work the same way the only difference is the capacity so well this one like this we'll just compare it Come on, come on, there. So you can put like a whole chicken in there. One whole chicken. Let's take it out entirely. There. There. And then compared to this, I don't know how many chickens you can put right there. I don't know. Maybe four if they're standing up. But uh, yep, there's a clear difference. See? It is definitely, well, it's amazingly easy to use one of those air fryers because yesterday it was Haley who did the cooking. It's very, very easy. Uh, we have those um, marinated chicken um, that we, we got from the grocery. And uh, all you do is just put it in. Well, obviously, you have to defrost it first. And then put it in straight, no oil. After 20, 25 minutes cook perfectly okay so for today we're gonna be trying to fry this the lumpiang shanghai so kinda position those that way let's go ahead let's put it in click clack and snaps let me show you guys how it sounds. So yep, that's how it sounds. Um, it's kind of like similar sound when you're beside your fridge. That kind of hum. What's happening here? Bro, what's up? Oh, I was looking for something. Well, we'll get back to you later. There's our lumpia. Yes, sir. Let's see how crispy it is. Well, is it hot? Oh, nice and crispy, bro. Now let's transfer it. Sorry, it is. See? Air fried lumpia. Bottom is a little white, but it's cooked. Then top is like that. But Crunchy, bro. Nicely done. Mm. Oh, yeah, and we're back. So, as you saw, it it was really or it is really easy to use. Even uh, even my daughter and my kid, my my son, um, they are they they know how. They both know how to use it. So they uh, they try. The other day, they they uh, cooked French fries, uh, chicken nuggets. Really easy. They they didn't have to add oil, whatever. 
um, I guess with with the with the air fryer, I think the only thing that you need to think about is really you know you have to make sure that for example the chicken or the the beef or whatever whatever you want to put you want you want to make sure that they are properly marinated so it has you know good flavors inside so that's how the obviously the lumpia was a was a was a was a success was a success and um you you'd be surprised guys on how how many things or how, yeah there are many many things that you can do with the air fryer it's not just limited to like frying stuff um I mean, vegetables you can do vegetables and just just look just look google it google it here in youtube look for like recipes of what to do so the reason i'm gonna tell you the reason behind why um why we got it um since pandemic right and uh we are working here at home so there is that we don't have like a, a maid or like a cook that can do it for us so there are days really that we're struggling on what what to eat uh, i mean what to cook or yeah since it's gonna really it's really gonna take our time especially if we're really tired from work or while we are working we're well as you can see we just have to put it in there and uh just wait for it because as before um it you would really take time to prepare stuff um especially if just just frying i mean compared before that uh my my kids really don't want to try that, uh to fry stuff yeah uh, the conventional way you know add the oil because obviously they're scared to to like you know get burned or whatever so now they can do it and i'm really happy about it and uh well i guess you know what the only thing that uh was challenging for me or the the least favorite thing i i like with air fryer is the cleaning um i don't know i i think it's just because it's new i was really careful in cleaning it i was really handling it carefully i don't want to have like dents on it and i want to make sure that when i scrub it i don't i i, I made sure that i don't scratch the non-stick coating so so it was uh, it took a while for me to to clean it also one thing i think that uh, i need to look into is the electricity bill the consumption i think that's something that i i, I should observe for the next couple of months so you know I, i'll know if if it's really gone up like you know significantly we'll see we'll see but other than that it's all good it's all good so well if you guys are like us you know both parents are working and uh the i mean yes you can cook but i mean if, if you can save time why not get something like this right well that's about it that's about it guys i will thank you for watching the video till the next one you have a good day spread the love guys bye bye